we're focused on at the minute is supporting the Prime Minister in trying to get a deal. You say that it looks highly unlikely. Of course they are going to say what, they're, what they have been saying for two and a half years because they have never been tested before in relation to this issue. It is very clear that it is the backstop that has caused all of the difficulties with the withdrawal agreement and therefore that needs to be the subject of focused negotiations to deal with it and therefore we will support the Prime Minister in doing that. Well a sensible Brexit is a Brexit that recognises that neither the British government, the Irish government or indeed ourselves here in Northern Ireland want to see a return to the borders of the past or indeed want to see infrastructure on the borders. What we want to see is a sensible way forward that recognises that the whole of the United Kingdom are leaving the European Union, the Republic of Ireland are staying in the single market and therefore we have to find a way of dealing with that. We can do that, I believe firmly we can do that, but there has to be a willingness on both sides to be able to achieve that. And when people talk about a confidence supply agreement that is toxic and has poisoned the well, I think those people who have benefited in the health service, in our schools, in our infrastructure, where we're going to get broadband uh, at the appropriate level across the province and not least in mm. the constituencies of Sinn Féin members who boycott and upset themselves from Westminster. Those are good things for the people of Northern Ireland. We're proud of those achievements and we can think we can achieve more going forward and certainly Boris Johnson is very, very committed to carrying that forward and we look forward to those discussions.